billionaire media mogul Thomas Cross was discovered early this evening, slain by multiple gunshot wounds. Cross was scandalously kidnapped this morning at the funeral of his only son, the claimant of opposition, Jordan Cross. An notorious recluse, Thomas Cross has not left the current line of the years, and authorities are now looking into a connection between the two deaths. Cross had billions in hidden offshore accounts, all stripped clean within hours of the kidnapping. Someone wanted the son dead to lure out the father. Someone smart enough to stay in the shadows while we did the wet work, and the Highmores picked up the check. A shadow client. Someone got rich. The contract was just. That was a sound problem. I know you don't care about politics, 47, but ICA is neutral, or as has been. Can't allow ourselves to be manipulated. Besides... It's happened before. Italy. Morocco. Paris. All our clients got their intel the same way. Anonymous tips from a hidden source. Each contract perfectly legit. Yet part of a grander design. I don't see the pattern. Somebody does. The board has asked us to chase down this shadow client, and our analysts are closing in as we speak. I know that tone. Someone's playing a game, 47. The question is... Kane's tomb. Good morning, 47. We have a lead on the Shadow Client. ICA White Hats have traced the anonymous data received by our clients to one Olivia Hall, brilliant young hacktivist and suspect in a dozen cases of cyber vandalism. Using onion routing with state-of-the-art encryption, Hall went to a lot of trouble to stay untraceable. She is good, but we are better. Her digital trail has led us to a remote farm in Colorado, where satellite footage has revealed what appears to be the training camp for a private militia, led by an already registered target, Sean Rose, Australian environmental terrorist and explosives expert wanted for a series of public bombings. Rose was spotted near the scene of Thomas Cross's kidnapping, which makes him our prime suspect for the shadow client. Spurred by Eric Soders, the ICA board of directors has asked us to infiltrate the farm and eliminate Sean Rose, along with three other prominent militia members. Ezra Berg, retired Mossad interrogator. Penelope Graves, former Interpol anti-terror analyst. And finally, Maya Parvati, former assassin and gunrunner for the Tamil Tigers. I'll be honest with you, 47. I consider Eric Soda's reasoning hasty and ill-advised. Now, we cannot go against the wishes of the board, but we can conduct our own investigation. Whether a direct threat to the ICA or not, we need to know the Shadow Client's true agenda. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Colorado, 47. The militia has taken up HQ at an old apricot farm and appear to be training for a series of coordinated strikes, ranging from cyber attacks to full-blown guerrilla warfare. The Shadow Client appears to unite specialists and radicals from all over the map. Mercenaries and terror spies joined by an unknown common cause. Satellite scans indicate that the command room is below ground inside an old tornado shelter. Only Rose appears to have access, however, so to get inside, you will need to get creative. This environment is hostile and highly alert, so tread carefully. 
Good luck, 47. Ezra Berg, legendary Mossad operative who specializes in chemical interrogation techniques, is here at the compound to interrogate a prisoner. My notes indicate he's set up a makeshift drug lab in a garage, and it looks like he's spending a lot of his time in the basement. Could be an opportunity there, 47. in charge of operations. I don't get it. Why'd the boss pick him? Why not Raynard? The way I see it, Raynard... Well, that's good work, so... Come on, let's watch it again.
Hi, recruit. Yeah, that's unfortunately not going to work. I can't let you through here. Bye bye. What the? Bloody wanking hell. So I've started practicing breathing underwater. If I train hard enough, I've heard that I'll develop gills after a while. A couple of years, I should be able to easily breathe underwater. So you gotta be dying to know what's the secret. Huh? Are you serious? Command, how do you read me? Over. Suspect remains unknown. Go come on, come in. You copy? Yeah, I'm here now. No, nothing. It's quiet here. Over. Roger that. Moving to that location. Out. How are you? The guy, the guy Ezra Hello, Berg sir. has tied up in the interrogation room. He's one of the enemy's couriers.
captured. Hold up a second, drive in. This guy is unbelievable. Do you know this crew? The grunts are here. Well done, 47. With any luck, the perfectionist Ezra Berg will want to examine his notes closely to figure out what happened. Ezra Berg has been eliminated. Good work, 47. Operation. Huh. Got clipped by a ram or something? The team trains with a battering ram to simulate the attack on Secretary Torres and Motorcade. I don't know. I guess old Burgess had his head up his ass. Nine out of ten accidents happen in the home. They do say that. Anyway, the guy was lucky. Sprained his ankle, that's all. He'll be back in a couple. So does uh, Rose still supervise the training? Sure. Why? Well, if we ever want to get rid of Rose without the boss knowing, I guess uh, Burgess just taught us how. Huh. I like your thinking. Tell Parvati, eh, man? It'll make her day. A battering ram has injured one of the strike team, Point Man by the name of Burgess, and according to those militiamen, Maya Parvati oversees training. Sounds promising. I suggest you infiltrate the strike team 47. Perhaps you can relieve the hapless Point Man of his duties.
So you got Rex Mill. Exfiltration plan. Rose's got it covered. Don't worry about it. I do worry, see, because I'm not an idiot. Execution's one thing, escape is another. Gustavo Torres is not just some corporate suit. He's bloody Secretary of the Interior. Well, it's a good thing we have the support of the locals. What does that mean? The Delgado cartel. Delgados? We're in business with the worst crime cartel south of the border. Politics makes strange bedfellows. And Get him! Shoot him! Now! I'm back. Stay away from well, me, sir. Well, well, my her. very own punching bag. Any broken bones? Wounded pride. That's all. Good to hear. All right, head over to the briefing area. We'll resume in a moment. Amnesia has set in. Here's the sequence. Advance to the car with haste. Eliminate the passengers. Retrieve the briefcase. Extract. Got that? And remember, speed and accuracy is the name of the game. All right. Now go pick up your weapons and get in position. Move out.
Parvati won't know what hit her. Maya Parvati is down. Good work. Intriguing. According to Graves' ledger on Sean Rose, he is hypersensitive to the effects of drugs, in particular, hallucinogens. Last time he tried, it triggered a nasty psychotic episode, channeling his fear of germs. Interestingly, the ledger also contains a record of his most recent OCD attacks. Desk, grandfather clock, and faucet. Hmm. Rose appears to smoke cigarettes when he gets agitated. What if... What's up, brother? Killing me. <laughs> oh, for... I thought I told you to find that battery. It's not a toy. Sean Rose confirmed down. Nicely done, 47. Greetings, sir. Subject, Sean Rose. Initial on-site profile notes. This is to be considered an addendum to my existing profile. Yeah, they're giving those vans a real makeover, huh? Forty-seven. It appears the door to the to the biometric lock. To gain access, you need Sean Rose's body, or something equally convincing.
Trust in you, Private. Hey! Come on, give me a break! Plot thickens. Someone left in a hurry. Sean Rose was... That much is clear. Whoever commands the militia, they got out just in time. Look around, 47. We're getting closer. Some kind of network. Power players. From all sectors. Familiar faces, too. Thomas Cross. Klaus Strandberg. Ether. And that's missing banker Eugene Cobb. Well, well. There's a name. Providence. What? No. No, it can't be. The Hidden Hand. Thought they were a myth. A hypothesis, nothing more. The idea that a small cabal of kingmakers, controlling enough corporate and political leaders, could effectively run the world in secret. Maybe not so hypothetical. Keep looking, 47. We need full disclosure. Found something. So does. But that would mean Providence has infiltrated ICA. And Eric Sodas is their operative. Bastard! It all fits. He was the one who persuaded the rest of the ICA board to greenlight this operation. This changes everything. Get out, 47. We got what we came for. What about the Shadow Client? He is no longer our primary concern. ICA has been compromised. I always wondered if the Providence was real, but I never actually... I will need to confer with the board, but mark my words, 47. This will have consequences.